watching a video from Psycho Cruises All in One Sport Bike Channel. Subscribe today. Warning this video is for entertainment purposes only. Items you'll need to plasti dip your helmet isopropyl alcohol, which is also known as rubbing alcohol, paper towels, one can of Blaze Yellow Plasti Dip. The link to buy this is in the info section of this video. A toothpick and a terry cloth towel. Step 1. Close all vents on the helmet. Step 2. Clean the helmet with isopropyl alcohol and a paper towel. Step 3. Stick a piece of wet paper towel in any open vents on the helmet that cannot be closed to prevent plasti dip from getting in the vents. Step 4. Apply the first coat of plasti dip in a thin, even layer all over the helmet. Tip. Always shake the can for a full minute prior to spraying. Also, do not apply a thick coat or you might get bubbling. Step 5. After 30 minutes of dry time, apply a second coat in the same manner. Step 6. Wait another 30 minutes for the second coat to dry before applying the third and final coat. Step 7. After applying the last coat, allow it to dry for a couple of hours before removing the plastic dip from the shield and or other areas of the helmet. Then take a toothpick to pierce through the plasti dip on the shield and shield levers. Then take your fingernail and peel off the plasti dip off the shield and levers. Step 8. Now remove the Plasti Dip from the rim of the base of the helmet with a terry cloth towel. Just rub it off with some applied pressure. Step 9. Let the Plasti Dip cure overnight before you ride with the helmet on your motorcycle. That's it. All done. Easy. Check it out. Looks like a brand new helmet. High viz yellow with a matte finish. Extra cheap for you cheap poop butts out there like me. Now you don't have to buy a new helmet. All you gotta do is plastic dip it. Check it out, even matches my high viz rain jacket. And my high viz vest looking good. Check it out. High viz versus white. High viz all day, baby. And it's time for. Cycle Cruisers recommended videos. Links are in the info section of this video. For those of you cheap riders out there that don't want to spend a lot of money on a winter riding jacket, but you want to ride on colder days, you might want to check out my high vis windproof, waterproof, windbreaker review video. You riders out there tired of wearing that heavy ass, hot ass, expensive leather motorcycle jackets in the summertime? Well, I got a better solution for you guys. Some urban streetwear that's lightweight, flows a ton of air, has even more protection than most of the motorcycle jackets out there. Full spine protection, full chest protection, full arm protection. You can even mount GoPro Heroes on it. Check out my review on the CE Armor Jacket. Yeah. Are you looking for an easy way to mount your action camera to your helmet? Something that's way stronger than Velcro? Well, I got a great solution for you guys. Check out my review on the Power Grip Pedal Tape. Wouldn't you love to ride around on your motorcycle with a nice, comfortable hoodie, but yet still have the CE-approved armor protection? 
Well, hey guys, I have the solution for you. Check out part one of my Armored Hoodie review. Also, check out part two of my Armored Hoodie review, where I do a road test and let you know if this Armored Hoodie is a real winner on the streets. Hey guys, check out my new channel where I talk about anything and everything, not just motorcycle related. Psycho Cruiser Motor Vlogs. Get your Psycho Cruiser sport bike themed apparel at PsychoCruiser.com. PsychoCruiser. Hey, join in on the discussion over at my forum at PsychoCruiser.com and also hit like on my Facebook page for new updates. And that's Facebook.com forward slash PsychoCruiser1.